Now, meteorologist Alex Herbst is out in the dust with the latest on how that Saharan cloud is making life in the valley a bit difficult, at least for some. Alex? Brian, as you can't really see it out here right now, but I'm surrounded by millions and even billions of different particles of sand, dust, and allergens that are really making this a painful season for allergy sufferers. Summer is usually a lower allergenic season. This year is different. Dr. Willem McKenna says there's a reason for that. A combination of heavy rain, wind, and additional irritants like Saharan dust are creating a mini spring and people across the valley are feeling the effects. This latest episode in, in the recent week has really kind of focused on, on Texas. Pollen from trees, grasses, and weeds, along with Saharan dust, are the primary allergens airborne at this time. This can exacerbate respiratory issues, Dr. McKenna tells us, while also leading to a number of nagging symptoms. These would be nasal symptoms that would be certainly things like sneezing, runny nose, uh, nasal congestion, certainly irritated eyes. And continued concerns over the second outbreak of Saharan dust to impact the valley this summer are not helping the situation. There's no question that this dust from the, the Sahara, the African dust, is causing problems with our patients. While there is no certainty over when a Sahara dust outbreak can or will happen, people are encouraged to take precautions like with allergies to protect themselves. Patients who have asthma, COPD, chronic sinusitis type of conditions, allergies, what those need to stay inside electively as much as they can. While hot days remain ahead for the valley in the dog days of summer, allergy sufferers can hopefully breathe a sigh of relief in the coming weeks. Out here, people are advised to go indoors if they are suffering from what they feel are allergies or potentially a cold. If you have serious symptoms, though, you are advised to go and visit your doctor. Outside here in Harlingen, outside the KGBT studios, meteorologist Alex Herbst, CBS4 Valley at 6.